When you talk about the guys, obviously Mello, Sean and, and um, Casey lined up for the first time together the other night. Was that fun to get out there with those guys? Yeah, they're so much fun. They're great dudes. Uh, I think they love playing ball as well, which makes it so easy. You know, you get out there and you get a run and we've just got to get going defensively, um, which every team does. Um, I think uh, once everyone knows our coverages and we know we build that trust, um, we're going to have so much fun this year, so I can't wait. Taking on Cairns on Friday night, what are sort of the keys that you see to sort of keeping them in check? Yeah, you know, the feedback from the game last night was that they're really trying to play at a high pace and um, you know, I think the fast break points were were massive, and so um, I think always in pre-season you really want to challenge yourself with the ability to sprint and get back and defensive transition. And um, they got a high-level guard in, in Machado that you know had 14 assists last night. So um, you know he'll be a good challenge not only for for Mello and and Sam Short, but for the whole group to try and you know, limit his impact. Match up against your former team on Friday night, Cairns, are you looking forward to that and do you think there might be some hostilities there? I mean, I think it's no bad blood. I mean, what I said, I think people took it, you know, out of left field, but the point intended was different, but, um, you know, I have too much love for Coach, Coach Kelly and uh, Jamie and uh, DJ, you know, teammate from last year, you know, me and DJ have been playing against each other since we were in college, so uh, there's no bad blood there. I mean, I'm very excited to play against Kansas. You know, it's my old team, the first team I played with since I've been in Australia, so I mean, I'm very excited to play, and also just another opportunity for us to get better, you know, going against the NBL team that we're going to play playing throughout the season, so I'm excited, you know, whether it's Kansas or not. I think Cairns will be pumped for the opportunity. Um, I don't know exactly everyone that they brought, but um, either way, it'll be a lot of fun. Um, any preseason hitouts, you know, we've been training and running and lifting for so long. Any games, you'll take it. And then Brisbane, obviously they sort of had the wood over us last year and, and Lamar Patterson's back. Are you looking forward to, to that matchup again? Yeah, they, they obviously added to their roster a little bit um, with some off-season moves and um, I'm sure they're really excited. And they got a couple guys away with national team as well. So, uh, I don't know, we'll, we'll see how the game go, but as I said before, it's it's just fun to play anybody at this point. Yeah, you know, Brisbane are one of the teams that, um, you know, disrupted us last year and um, didn't let us get into our offensive system um, as well as some other teams did. And uh, so, we, you know, we've got to find some solutions for them this year. We're going to make sure that um, whatever pressure or whatever disruption they throw at us, that, you know, we're still capable of you know, getting good shots and getting high quality shots. And is it fun to get out in front of the fans again? Absolutely, yeah. I, I love that we've had some fans turning up to different places and, you know, we pop around Victoria, we go to Ballarat, go to Casey, um, played at the State Basketball Centre, so it's good to always get different crowds in as well.